if you haven't played in a long time, it's phenomenal. Uh, Storm, thank you for the sub. Uh, Flamorphic Blue, thank you for the gift sub. Enjoy your... Enjoy your backpack. Oh, I forgot my water. I'll be right back one second, guys. Thank you for following. to make some more water. We need water filters. Where do we make those? Probably at the Tinker Station. Probably the science station. Let's see. Boiled water. Healing energy. Unrefined gunpowder. Well, let's see. Let's go ahead and store all of our stuff. Probably carrying a lot of, uh, yep. Carrying a lot of stuff. Let's see, aid. Find meat from animal kills. Item. Oh, now it's happening. Miscellaneous. Did I actually read that one book? Maybe I didn't. I thought I had a science book. I guess maybe I didn't actually read it. I think they respawn though, so it'll be fine, but. Oops. Okay, let's store some chemicals. Mystery bobblehead. Let's see what that does. Bobblehead caps added. Bobblehead agility added. What is Thank that? Thank you for following. What does that do for me? Thank you for the follows, Lazy Dave. Are those? Oh, there it is. Better cap. Better cap stashes. Agility. Oh, bobbleheads are timed buffs. That's right. I forgot. They're not permanent things. It's been a while. Have to remind myself all this stuff. You know what? We should go sell these. Um... Thank you for following. Sell everything to what you would call it, the vendor. Chems are worth quite a bit. Why don't we dilute it? Psycho Orgeman Tets. Right, let's go over there and sell everything. Thank you, Spin His Ham, Mr. Loopy, Razaquil. We're playing on PC. 
I've never played uh, Fallout on console. Thank you for following. I just really need a mouse. I don't know. It's hard for me to play this without a mouse keyboard because there's so much shooting involved. I know. Oh, my character is thirsty. Oops. Got some boiled water. Whatever ale. Purified water. Um. I need to go cook some of this meat. Oh, I gotta have so much spoiled meat. Oh lordy. We at the Great Hi. Sweepstakes appreciate your continued purchases and subscriptions. However, we would like to remind you that your bill in the amount of seventy-three thousand four hundred twenty-eight dollars and sixty-six cents is overdue, and prompt payment is appreciated. Have a great day. Seventy-three thousand dollar bill. Holy shit! Must be price per day. The super cozy and secret dance stream. Um, this one isn't, but the Twitch stream normally is. Super comfy. How you get one hundred twenty FPS? Um, by turning on my super powerful PC built by Starforge Systems. You looking at me? How about you stop uh, looking and start, start buying. buying? I'm gonna sell those to you. Those are worth quite a bit. Yeah, these are worth a lot. This vendor unit is equipped with anti theft measures. Don't get any ideas. Well, let's get rid Jump. of a few of them. Really use those caps. All right, thank you, sir. Okay, I already got all of those. It'd be cool if they set up a working train between the train lots. I don't know. It, vehicles don't seem to work in this engine very well, though. So maybe they can't. Okay, what are some daily stuff we could still do? Uh, eat meat-based meal. Harvest corn, razor grain, tato. Kill a mole miner. Cook meat-based meal. Well, I do have some, some meat in my inventory. Let's go back and craft it. Let's see what we can do. Alright, crafting. Let's do meat. Grilled rat roach. Rat roach. Roasted ants. Plenty a lot more. Right, let's pick a quest and go do it. We need to level up. Study Dr. Hudson's research. Investigate um, Morgantown. Attend the nightclub. Go to White Spring Refuge. Get to level 20. Okay, we need to get inoculated um, to the Thank you for following virus. We need to go down that way to get inoculated. Let's head down that way. So down this road. Oh, we do have level up. Let's level up. Uh, let's see. We have like no endurance. Total health. Agility, luck. Intelligence. Experience gain. Um, obtain more components when you scrap weapons and armor. I'll take that. That sounds nice. Right, let's go back this way. 
But yeah, the way it works is if you gift one paid sub or you buy a sub for yourself or a resub. Uh, it can't be Prime. Prime doesn't work. Uh, you'll get a backpack code for this backpack I'm wearing, the Vault 33 backpack. It's a skin you can put on any of your backpacks in game. Once you give the, once you sub or gift a sub, you'll get a notification at the top of the screen, and that's when you redeem it um, on the website. When you click on it, ugh. Okay, Taco Bell. What? That was a mistake. Uh oh, hi. Save the boy, asshole. <laughs> Oh man, sorry. Sorry. Dear God. Said something about his. Hmm. Congratulations! Sorry, I don't. Own, I don't own anything anymore. My debt's officially canceled, I believe. I think that's how that works. Kaboom. I think if you uh, take out the quest giver, then they can't can collect the dead anymore. Let's eat grilled rad roach and roasted ants. Sorry, Mr. Prizebot. Thank you for all those subs, guys. Appreciate that. Thank you for the follow as well. Oh. Oh, oh dear God. That guy's hitting hard. I was not expecting that to be going off like that. That was revenge for Prizebot. I deserve that. You know. That's what I get for harming prize bot. Uh, Rodenderon? Yeah, my favorite part about the Fallout TV show is just like seeing something from the game in it and going, oh my god, that's, that's this, or that's that, or that's that sound. They use a lot of the game sounds from the game in the show, which is great. So you like, will hear a sound, you're like, oh my god, that's the blank sound. Yeah, they did a good job with the mutants so far, too, making the mutants look like they do in the game. Yeah, the little the store that she goes into has a bunch of Easter eggs. He's got to pause the video and look at everything in that room. There's a lot of good stuff in there. Wait, do I have a disease? Nope. Mothman Equinox. Oh wait, there's uh, we can go up here and get do basic training too. That's a easy quest. I think the uh, things up here. Yeah, a little camp. Why is everyone so hype over this game again? Is the show releasing it? Um, it's a mix of. People being hyped about Fallout again because of the show, and then people playing this game and realizing just how good it's gotten over the years. From its pretty, pretty rocky, pretty buggy, rough start, it's now a really good game. They've done a very good job at changing everything. And people are like surprised by just how good it is. They're like, whoa! Yeah, it was, the game became uh, good in 2020 when they finally added NPCs. 
And then it's just gotten better and better over the years as it's they keep adding stuff. You actually prefer no NPCs? It would be cool if they could launch a world that existed without any NPCs again. Say like um you want to like experience what it was like when the game launched, you know? Yeah, like I I enjoyed I enjoyed the um the experience of how they told the story in the original campaign. I thought it was fun. But it wasn't for everybody. Not everyone enjoyed it. Hello, sir. Hey, this is US Army property. Or what's left of it? Whoa, golly, a uh, civvy. Whoa, golly. This is army property, so Oh, wait. Are you a soldier? A real soldier? There's no more soldiers, son. The world got war got the last of them. Well, uh, you know, that may be the case, but don't you think it's time we rebuilt the army? It's been years. I mean, who knows how many stinking commies are still lurking out there. We gotta gun them all down, I say. I'm ready to go. I just need the order. You've got an order for me, right? Uh... Drop it, give me 20! Oh, I know this one! Uh, but, um... <laughs> Could I maybe get to that tomorrow? All this drilling has really worn me down. Rifles are heavier than I thought. What's the point of me giving you an order and you don't, like, do it? I order you to move out into the wasteland, recruit. Right away. Oh, are, are, are you serious, sir? <laughs> I'm, I'm really going to go f fight? I, uh, <clears throat> I wasn't. You know, uh, Sarge had me. I'm on latrine duty, and, uh, I'm gonna have to belay that order on account of, well, you know. <laughs> what? Like, are, do you, what do you, what is it you do here, would you say? Answer some questions, recruit. Okay, um, which question exactly? Um... How is Camp McClintlock holding up? The camp's in tip-top shape, sir! Well, the important bits. We have uniforms, weapons, ammunition, and then there's the training course. It works! I did it. Well, most of it. Okay, some of it. But it's automated, and it does work. You can run, jump, shoot. Oh, the rifle range is great. Though it doesn't teach you how to unjam a firearm. Most of all, it's safe. Unlike out there. Uh, what level are we? I think we're 17, or might be... I think we might have just turned 18. What's your background recruit? Me? Private Joe Cray. Well, private in training, sir. I came up from Virginia. East Virginia? Well, I'm from the coast. I started out a civvy, though I guess we all do. I'm not that way anymore, though. I can fight the Reds, and I'll prove it. Just as soon as I can finish that darn obstacle course. Um, kid, you're gonna get yourself killed. Why do you want to join the army so badly? My whole family's in the army. Well, they were before the war. We've had family in the army since 1776. It's a tradition. And besides the Reds, those bombs. Who wouldn't want to join up after what they did to this country? Not to mention all the other dangerous stuff out there. No, the, no for the questions. Understood. I'm not gonna order you around. Oh come on! You know I'm good for it. I... It. Oh come on! I can do whatever you need. Load a machine gun. Carry cargo. I can even swab a poop deck if you want me to. Can... Do you have a ship? Can you swab a poop deck? Roger. I'll hold down the fort. Camp. Whatever, sir. Kid. All right, let's see. Start your training at Camp McClintlock. Ooh, Overseer Log. Overseer's Log. Camp McClintock. Whew. Maybe I'm going crazy. 
But it was nice to put on the uniform and play pretend with a bunch of robot drill sergeants. I actually think I learned a thing or two about marksmanship. I wonder, now that I'm in the army, is my official title Overseer Private or Private Overseer? <laughs> oh, time to see if I can fool a few automated identification systems. Yeah, well... Thank you for following. All, all we know for sure is that both sides launched a bunch of bombs at the same time for total annihilation. And they destroyed a good chunk of the world. It might be interesting if they do another Fallout game and they show it from the perspective of, of the Reds. Like, what their perspective, what their side of the story is in, like, another country. It'd be an interesting, like, take on, um, Fallout to see, like, what's it like on the other side? What happened? Rich damage from airborne diseases. Military fatigues. Sir, yes, sir! Well, let me take off my, um, outfit. We'll scrap my um, outfit. Military fatigues, Ranger helmet. Look how I remake that again. Keep my backpack on though. Uh, that sounds like uh, some red talk. Whoa, uh, Irish. I meant like, uh, you know, as an exercise to show how great America is. Um, I would never, never. Uh, um, yeah, uh, sorry. Uh, go America. Red, white, and blue. Freedom. All right, let's turn off this one. Oh, follow the overseer's journey. Start your training at Camp McClintlock. Sir, can I uh, join the army? Hmm. Well, what do we have here? Hi. What in the holy name of... You are out of uniform, cadet. And with no uniform voucher, you will return in army fatigues and helmet, or you will not return at all! I, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Uh... Sir. Uh, yes, yes, sir. Uh, oh God, I don't have a, uh, need a hat. Search the area for uniform disbursement log. Um, return cadet sent to recover voucher from barracks. Search the barracks for private Archibald's, um, uniform. Where, where, where is the barracks? I gotta go find. I'll think for that follow. Uh, is the game so glitchy? No, they've done a really good job of hammering out all the bugs. They also have a bunch of NPCs and stuff. The game's a lot bigger than it wa wa was when it launched originally. Occasionally you get a crash once in a while, but you know, not too often. I think we had like one crash today. Military fatigues. Uniform voucher. Collect your uniform. Oh, at the machine? Let's take a look-see. Do they still have machines over here? Thank you, Voidstar uh, and Falcon for the subs, guys. Thank you so much. Oh, here we go. Uniform issued. Okay, peril. Dirty fatigue, dirty helmet. Uh, can I change my backpack to look a little more military style? Let's see. Modified backpack. Backpack. 
That looks a little more, a little more military. A little bit. Good lord, your guy's thick. I know he's thick like butter. He's thick like oatmeal. Stuff. All right, up this way. All right, now we're gonna become a soldier, Chat. Greatest salute with Dan Seven. Now that's what I like to see. All dolled up and ready to die for your country. There are All right, sorry, Dan F. Dan F. You'll need to complete. Marksmanship, agility, and patriotism. Our courses, like all things in the great territory of Appalachia, are automated. So you over-promoted mammals can do the mess you see fit. Complete the courses to my satisfaction, and we'll get you moved on to the real test. Sir, yes, sir. Yes, sir. On the battlefield. Let's give a monthly description. Um, you, there's an optional one. You don't, have to, you don't need it, but if you want to, you can. Marshmallow training course. When given the signal, shoot all the targets as quickly as possible. Um, all cadets must check in with Master Sergeant in the admin building before starting the exercise. Okay. Hit the targets. Yes, sir. Dan F. Rope you have to walk across, no joke. I'll, I'll look out for that. All right, won't need my gun for the next part. Agility training course. Uh-oh. Uh, when given the sentiment, three top skill triggering all the buttons present, overcome all the obstacles in order to complete the course. Got it. Okay, here. There. Uh oh. Oh no. Okay, there. Oh god, it's dirty water. Okay, hit. Hit here. Okay. Hit that one. Thank you. Okay, go, 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 go. One minute, one second. Not bad. You've got just one more course to clear. Sudden impulse. Thank you for the sub. Enjoy your backpack. I love that dirty water. Me too. It's the best. Um, last course is over here. The patriotism training course. Patriotism. The hell's patriotism course? Jimmy Topher and Jean Jun have been accused of supporting collective action. 
a gateway drug to communism. Talk to suspected traders, search their rooms, collect evidence to uncover the budding communist. To pass, collect the evidence on which boy is the budding communist. All cadets must check in with the master sergeant and admin before starting the exercise. Really? Right. Moxie didn't give me sub. Daddy didn't think for the gift subs. All right, uh, Jin Jan. This area is way different from San Francisco. The winters are so cold. Yeah? This country gave my family a fresh start. It's pretty patriotic. I like it. Someday, I'm going to own my own car. Or two. Capitalism, we love that. Was there anything else, sir or madam? Polite. I love America. Oh, my God, the patriotism. This area is way different from San Francisco. All right, let's see. Dirty ashtray. Okay, uh, Jean says he looks pretty clean so far. Uh, this guy's lying on the ground. That's a not a good sign. Let's see. Jimmy. My favorite holiday? Well, that'd have to be the 4th of July. That's America. We like that. Well, yeah, my pop's in the union. Why do you ask? Okay, union. My terminal keeps me company while pop is at the mine. I needed a new password, so I use the initials of someone I admire a lot. Admire a lot? Who do you admire? Am I free to go? I love America! My favorite holiday? Hmm. Well, that'd have to be the 4th of July! Let's see here. Jimmy's Diary, May 2nd. Dear Diary, today at school we learned about Franklin... Delano Roosevelt, FDR, to his chums, as they say, did so much help the people of this country that they were having a hard time to use the government to try and improve people's everyday lives. What a stand-up guy. Uh, if he were alive today, I'd ask him for an autograph. Maybe he'd join a baseball team. Hmm. Probably FDR. Class today. In class today, Mr. Brown did a chemistry experiment where he lifted a weird silvery rock on fire. It burned right through Jin John's desk. Boy, that was nifty. Later, we took a quiz. I didn't do so good because my tummy's rumbling so much. Wish we could have breakfast like the other families, but Pop says there isn't the money. After class, Mr. Brown asked uh, me to stay, and he asked and asked me to, if I'd eaten anything that day. I told him the truth. He gave me a piece of his sandwich. He said folks like us, the working class, needed to look out for one another. So I should come back after class tomorrow. We can talk about it some more. Saw something in the woods. Was in the woods looking for something to eat until Pop got home with dinner when I saw a big creature. It was all pale and muscular. It didn't have a head. I named it Morton, but it didn't come when I called it. It just started running off. I followed after it, but couldn't keep up. I wonder where Morton's finding so much food to get so big. Pop was coughing again. Pop's been coughing like crazy the past couple days, but the mine boss says he's got to work really worried about him. Mitchell says his pop's been suffering from the same thing. No more. Today I'm going to call up my friends and we're going to get all our pops to take to all take the day off together. Maybe a day after that. Maybe a day after that too. We'll show those mine bosses they can't boss us around. Their workers aren't just pawns in their capitalist schemes. We're going to organize a strike. <gasps> oh my god. That's communism. Oh. Disgusting. Disgusting. Oh. Oh, that's horrifying. My ancestors came over on the Mayflower. Like it? I work at my neighborhood soda counter. Though I'd love a raise. Capitalism? Okay. Now, where'd my diary get to? That's about all I gotta say on the subject. A little suspicious. I love America. Do you? My ancestors came over on the Mayflower. Let me find your little diary, sir. Gotta make sure that you're patriotic. Might have two communists. Which would be one, two, too many. Not in my America. Oh, let me get the rested buff while I'm here. 
Mortar on with a hundred and eleven month three sub. Thank you very much. Uh, Gaisuk three three zero. Thank you for the prime sub. Hello, Paul Mon. Thank you much, Carlo, for holding our shirt for that long. That's a very impressive. Can I get the buff? Not yet, I don't think. Mm. There we go. Where? Oh, he doesn't have any diaries or anything, so... That must be it for him, unless there's something I'd not seen. Well, definitely, Jimmy is a little communist. Cue's Jimmy. Live fire course. Lot live fire? Uh that's a little scary. Uh Ukule Bear, thank you for the sub. Enjoy your backpack. Alright, let's go ahead and get up and see what the live fire course is all about. Live fire terminal. Eliminate the communist menace. Okay. Attention! All cadets waiting to complete the live fire training course should grab their favorite firearm and proceed to the training site. That is all. So do I have, is there going to be a communist and I have to put them down with freedom? Five seconds, okay. Hands on swivel, cadets. Sounds like there's commies coming. Commies! Oh my god. Where? Oh my god, he's red! Cause he's a communist! <laughs> Where, where? Thank you. Capitalist. Got him. Communist robots now? Oh, God. What about freedom? What about America? Thank you, Saramashi and Nanaki. Thank you for the subs. Enjoy your backpacks, guys. Eliminate the group of communists. Got him! All right, not bad. Go ahead and get that oh, one more no. bolt in there. More commies inbound. What? Whatever will you do? Bag them and tag them, kiddos. More. Identify yourself. Commencing attack on hostile target. <laughs> Can't tell if I'm actually hitting. Nope. Not doing enough damage. Uh. 
Back off, robot. Over until the danger has been eliminated. <laughs> okay, re reloading. I'll take the lead. The worker will be the seat of all. Please stand clear. This Got him. Alright, let's heal. Okay, reloading. For America. Oh, it missed. You can respect pretty easily now, so feel free to like just do whatever as you're leveling, and then you can change everything later. He did say Fallout. You know what that means? Roll credits. Also, it shows all the different bodies up here that are nearby. That's awesome. I love the AOE looting. Hopefully, base game follow gets that. I could use that in when I'm playing single player. Panda Galaxy TV, thank you for the prime gaming sub. Uh, Panda Galaxy TV, you've been randomly selected. What is going to be your first ever subscriber remote? Click the little smiley face in chat and decide what's going to be your first ever subscriber remote. And then we will all type it for you. Hmm. Oh, Dana Ware. Good choice. Good choice. It's like you're just, you're just enjoying the stream, just watching, having a good time, and all of a sudden the streamer makes you pick an emote. And you're like, uh oh. Uh oh. Dan aware. Well, well. My sensors tell me you're not nearly as dead as I expected. Impressive, cadet. Or should I say, private. You are now an official member of the United States Army. Yeah. Get out there and do us proud, soldier. You are dismissed. Hell yeah. Soldier certificate added. Pull hook, gold, pre-war money. The Herald supports Quinn Carter by Lech Charles, uh, Charleston Herald. Public cries for Mr. Carter's resignation, followed by her interview with now former Senator Sam Blackwell. Oh, that's a whole thing that we'll get into later. Ooh, level up! Level 19, chat! We did it. Uh, let's see. What? Pack rat's pretty good. Concentrated fire. Which one is shotguns? Just 
Look way less. I think it's an endurance of shotguns. I think something weird like that. Perception. Base, uh, automatic rifles do more damage. Vats now targets limbs. Uh, attacks ignore 20% armor of any insect. Rifles now reload faster and a better hip fire accuracy. Um, non automatic rifles now do more damage. Shotguns have improved accuracy and spread. I do like that. Actually, nope. Can equip the big lock for now, though. Butcher's Bounty. Well, that could be scrapped. We already have one. Rifle bid. Thank you, manager, bombers, every chemdog OG, Henata. Oh my gosh, so many subs. Thank you guys. <laughs> guys are amazing. Oh, uh, we got a soldier certificate. Let's see what that is. Miscellaneous soldier certificate. And recognition. Uh, Department of Defense, Randy Shell Completion and Elements Base Training that's to be awarded to commemorate your induction in military service. Rank of private. Certificate cannot be used to identification. Can be not be used to identification purposes to get a proper ID. Go to Charleston Capital DMV building. Oh, I remember that quest. That's a funny one. Alright, well now we are private. Hello, soldier. Hi again. Marching orders? Goodbye. I guess nothing else for you. Just like an interesting NPC. Who's in this tower over here? Sometimes they like to put little things in little buildings. Never know until you go look. Looks like there is... 100% of nothing here. Perfect. Didn't want anything. Just wanted a waste of my time. And if I land on the fence, I shouldn't take any damage. Oh. <laughs> well. Oh, graduation ceremony. Kent McClintock has been training U.S. soldiers. U.S. Army soldiers for five glorious years. You, class. Are the last graduates taught by honest to goodness human drill sergeants. Go out there and show them that the old ways are the good ways. I want you to. If I may interject, Sergeant, that'll be all. Thank you, thank you. I want to say, as your governor, I am enormously proud of all of Appalachia's sons and daughters today that are graduating. And I want to say the future of Appalachia is going to be even brighter as we bring in a new age of automation to train new soldiers for the fronts faster and more efficiently. But today and tonight is yours to celebrate. Thank you. So they replaced all of the drill sergeants with robots. <laughs> Probably to save a few dollars. Typical. All right, let's go check out Dr. Hudson's research to get inoculated against the disease. Thank you, Raku64, for five gift subs for chat. Thank you very much. How'd you like the show? I'm still wor working on it, but it's been really, really good. I've been absolutely loving it. It's been so much better than I ever thought it would be. 
So I have been pleasantly surprised by that. Pre-war money. You have a crush on Ella Purnell? Is that the uh, vault dweller lady? I think that's her name. She's in a lot of shows lately. Yeah, she's very pretty. Did you know that she's actually not a vault dweller, though? I was surprised that she lied like that. I thought she was. I was like, wow, finally a real mutant, a real uh, vault dweller. But no, apparently she was lying about the whole thing. Gotcha. Sir. Super mutant. She's also not an American. What? Are you soon, human? It's amazing how many British actors there are. The, or actors with heavy accents that aren't that have really good American um, accents that you think that they are. Like I didn't know that um, Doctor House was British. I didn't realize that the guy who plays um, Rick in Walking Dead is British. And then when I hear them speak their actual language, like on a late night show, I'm like, why does Doctor House have a British accent? What is going on? Take the tin can. All that stuff there. This place is huge. Wade Airport. I think it's just a giant place to claim if you want it. I'll claim as you get like a, a free recipe when you claim these. Floating Nasher. Shit. Okay, and then, oh, two over there. Careful. Oh, that guy's a legendary. There's a high priest there, too. How does that keep missing him? Just like going right past him. Got him. Legendary cultist high priest. Protect you from this. Oh, I ascend. Ooh, cultist, uh, high priest pack. All right, let's see what. All right, what do we get? We have we got a weightless trapper chest piece, minus ninety percent weight. That's cool. So these guys apparently drop a a bag that I can open for rare stuff. 
Okay, I got Mintats, Mothman Egg, Stem Pack, Psycho. Oh, is that it? Nothing else? Aw. I'll take that. The chest has two legendary effects? Oh, does it? Inspect. Oh, cry resistance and weight. Ooh, very nice. Oh, hi there. Got him. <laughs> Still so many more to go through over here. Stew pot. Uh, yeah, uh, we're, the damage numbers are on. Clear enemies at Wade Airport. <laughs> Got him. Uh, no, we're not on a private world. There's just, the maps are really big. You rarely run into the people. If you're not doing an event. Gotcha. Charging laser sniper rifle. It's Gep. Thank you for the sub. Appreciate that. Stream is buttery smooth. Um, I'm streaming on an, uh, a very good PC built by our sponsor, uh, Starforge Systems. No one, like, does PvP for these, uh, workshops anymore. It used to be a thing, but not so much. People don't give a shit anymore about them. Hold on to your butts! Workshop claimed. I should get a recipe for claiming this too. I got metal signs. Large water purifier and a sign. Beautiful. Alright, uh, what these do, they let you, um,. Toggle camera. Can I scrap for resources or that? Uh... So what what you can do with these um, giant places you can build uh, resource deposits. You have to defend against waves of enemies and stuff. Oh, I didn't loot the legendary super mutant. right. I need to go loot his body. But first, I need to break something down. Let me, um... I have too much stuff in my inventory. Let's do crafting... First, let's do stash. Stash. Ammo box. And a regular stash. And then we want at least one crafting station so I can... I can break down everything I got. All right, scrap.
Ew. Hunting rifle, snub nose pistol. Alright, uh, now let's go loot that guy over there. Well, I should repair my armor, looks like. Modify repair. Oh, we got it. They're going to attack me, so I need to get some defenses quickly. Some basic defenses is all. Let's see. Defenses. Those are some fences, but I need just turret platforms. Go turrets. Okay, quickly. Attacking any second now. Take that, Barrel Ghoul. Barrels. <laughs> His head just went pop. All right, gorgeous. <laughs> Jump for joy. Okay, second wave of ferals, and then we should be left alone for a while. Was that Will Farrell? <laughs> oh. Those turrets are actually not doing bad against the ferals. Not bad. Oops. Got him. Hey, Yami, thank you for the Prime Gaming sub. Appreciate that. More like Colin Farrell. <laughs> all right, take all those guys out. Got him. <laughs> All right, perfect. Now there should be a spot or two here to like get resources. Get where they are, but somewhere around here are resource nodes. 
gun placement. Ooh, prepare that. Ooh, very nice. Yeah, the, the season uh, change is really nice. It's The other one was kind of tedious if you wanted, didn't care about a lot of the rewards. You just had to, you were forced to go through this giant track, but now you can just sort of just do the exact reward you want. Vertebrate landing pad. Ooh. Ooh. Oh, I can't get in. You just bought the Gatlin gun plan? Hell yeah, Julia. I want you to, this is what I want you to do to the enemies. I want you to go like that. The only bad thing about the Gatling is that it takes a lot of ammo. You have to constantly be dealing with ammo in that one. Um, where are the resource notes here? Oh, here's one. What? No. Is there an easy way to tell where these... Let's see. Um, resources. Is there a way to like see quickly where these go? Oh, right there. There we go. Perfect. Metal extractor. Okay, that saves a lot of time. Why is it never counter players? Because the, the maps are huge. It's rare to ever meet someone in the game outside of an event. The map's quite big, and there's only 24 players on a server. How about this one? Oh. Oil extractor. Put one over there, too. And then, what's this? Uh, silver extractor? Chief Mo, thank you for a 17 month resub. Iron Chef Wookie, thank you for that brand new sub. Enjoy your Enjoy your backpack, guys. Not seeing the silver. Not seeing a silver dispenser spot anywhere. Maybe I'm just missing it. Ammo points, ammo converter. I have no idea. I gotta give each of those things a um some power connectors. That has to be in water, so that's not gonna work. Lock that. Um. Oh my god, that guy's sexy. Don't 
No, this is not an MMO because it's only 24 players on a server. Just a multiplayer open world game. It's not massive at all. A lot of people playing it, but they're all separated on little servers. Make sure I lock that so no one can take it. Thank you for following. Ooh, thank you for the follow. There's one right there. Thank you, Angel Dead, for the follow. Appreciate that. Um, power. Alrighty then. Let's go put everything. Let's go. Now we got that going. Get some free resources. People visit your camp. Once you log out, your camp goes with you. Uh, you are... You are... Um, your camp and you and the one are the same. And once you log out, it's gone. Um, the game makes it so that you can easily move your camp wherever you want. And also save its current lo location. I mean, it's current setup, so you can just plop the whole thing back down. Oh, it's only 24 per instance. But uh, friends can join other friends, so it goes to max of 40. Oh, interesting. So it, it like, could be several groups past that. Okay. Store junk. I didn't mean to put it in there. Uh, let me grab these. Let's make our backpack the vault. The backpack again. Uh, oh, backpack flares? Ooh. A mod, right flare. I don't want the same flare. All right, let's try to get our inventory down because right now we have a lot of stuff. Um, we have a lot of albino ragstad blood for some reason. Add fi oh, got lots of notes. Let's put the notes away. I think it's not like a important one. We'll take the oh plans. Take that back out, please. And the treasure maps we'll hold on to. Treasure map. Soldier's certificate. Hold that one. Thank you for following. Junk mods. Hollow tapes don't cost anything, so we'll put those there. Those don't cost you a thing. You can hold on to those. I'm going to find Cole can go in there, though. 
Let's put everything in here. We need quite so many. We'll Tesla's Tesla science, it's right there. Perfect. Put the spoiled stuff in there. Sugar, sugar bombs, vodka. I'm trying to get all my way done. I have way Thank too you for much. Following. Way too much stuff. Weapons. Okay, still, still not quite at. I want it to be even less weight. We're still carrying too much stuff. I guess they have too much purified water. That's a lot of it. Sword. That'll do it. Um... way a bit as well um, put that in there I know I know I'm just like a hoarder I just pick up everything <laughs> shove it in my bag then I end up like having get to that point where I have to like every two seconds pick something up and then throw it away okay let's do any meat nope food Mothman omelet. Mm. Delicious. That sounds uh, just uh, wonderful. <laughs> Perfect. Gorgeous. All right, let's go ahead and go across. Defend Poseidon Energy Plant. Hmm. I can't remember if that's hard enough. I can't travel there for free. Oh, wait. It's an event, so I can... Could do that event again for some XP. Yeah, might as well. Mothman Equinox uh, apparently has good rewards, right? You rock! Thank you, Timothy. We're on we're on PC. All right. Um, I'm helping players. I am so helping. Totems and higher. I am helping, actually. But our work is far from complete. False prophets of the pretenders clamber throughout this sacred ground. Their presence corrupts. Oh, the albinos, you're supposed to put the blood in a trough, not just kill them. Okay. The guy's name is Friendly Napalm. So friendly. Okay, let's do some soup. Purified water, eat some omnits as well. Kill pro 
cultist prophets. Prophets. I don't know where they are. Aha! Aha! Take that, villain! Democracy! The ritual site has been prepared. The summoning <laughs> shall commence once each of the pyres has been lit. Go! Ignite the flames as I release the dust of our wise one into the air. How about no? Ah, yes. The flames of our pyres ignite the moth dust. It offers enlightenment, however brief it may be. Breathe, children. Breathe. Now through his eyes, children. Uh oh. Let the dust and flames and fumes fill you. Let it soak into your throats. Let it show you the truth. But prepare yourselves, for the heretic Jimpons will be enraged by this vision. <laughs> the reality of our wise one will send them into a frenzy. <laughs> you must protect our sacred lights. Wow, look at that guy's helmet. Damn. Wretched fiends. Without the fire's glow, our guest may refuse an invitation. <laughs> Demons approach the church. Slay them, children. Offer no quarter. That guy has such a cool, like, uh, skull helmet. It's green skull. Look at this guy's helmet. It's amazing. It's like a green glowing skull. Let not your eyes deceive you. All you see before you must die. No matter its shape, man or beast, these twisted shadows all serve the will of the false one. I'm helping. This big uh, armored man is definitely not doing all the work. I am definitely helping. The foul dim ones are headed toward the waterside fire, children. You must protect it. Gotcha. Short Gatling gun. Looks like this group's doing good though. We'll probably do the event just fine. All the things got pretty good health. I am so helping! Got him! Okay, keep reloading. Yeah, for me, they're my level, but for him, they're his level, 317. Uh, why 
Water side fire. No, to my fire. One HP left. Uh oh. Oh no, water side fire. Boo. No. Do you feel it? The wise one draws near. He awaits our signal. Quickly, children, return to me upon the museum's rooftop. Ooh. A must legendary him to us to show him our love and our gratitude. Dance, sing, shout, expel bile from your gut, show emotion. Show you hear us, wise one? Come unto us. That expansion you feel in your mind, that growing yes. sense of wisdom and foresight. He comes, children. Uh, uh oh. Show him. Show him what you are. Show him your truth. He will show you in time. <laughs> Level 20. Nice. Come, children, allow the wise one to gaze upon you. Bask in his infinite wisdom. Give me the buff, sir. Give me the buff. <laughs> Did I get the buff Mothman? No, I don't have it yet. Oh, there we go. Moth Truism the Mothman, 15% bonus XP. Nice. Not bad. And we leveled up. Let's open that perk pack. Let's see what we got. 30 frame. All food satisfies additional um, hunger. Why was Cinderella awful at bowling? She always ran away from the ball. Perception. Ah. <laughs> Rifles do more damage. I think now we could. Oh no, rifleman! I need six. Never mind. Just have to wait. Thank you, Mothman. All right, let's go back to where we were. Over here. Loving the Fall Show on episode five. Yeah, it's great. The new. The, the current ep the the show is amazing and I hope that them it doing so well will let them have a bigger budget for next time to do an even longer bigger show because they it just like so good it's amazing the only thing that would make that show even better is that if the membership I used to watch it would give me a sub on Twitch as well. Like, that's the only thing I can think of that would make it any better. But, Dan, what? 
But then there is a thing called Prime Game. What? <laughs> New photo frame, Charleston. Uh oh. Hello, is anyone here? This is Charleston, West Virginia. The doctors. Looking for metal system. This is uh, strictly DIY at this point. Oh. Nuka Cola Cherry. Thank you. I gotta get over there. So, pretty far in that direction. All right, I need to sit on the toilet and hide for just a minute because we have something to do really fast. We need to talk about our sponsor disc plate. Oops. Give me a second. All right, uh, this segment of the stream is sponsored by our sec our uh, monthly sponsor, Displate. What are Displates? Displates are metal posters that you see on the wall behind me. They hang up on the wall with magnets. Yeah. Look at these bad boys. So the ones that we have one behind me, uh, this one is uh, Tifa is I'm hiding behind the bush, giving tactical assistance to Tifa, who is fighting off the monsters for me. Um, this is our one from Horror Month. This is me as Shaggy, Tifa as uh, Scooby Doo, and then the monsters. Drawn, both were drawn by Julia. Metal post. These are displays are metal posters, just like this one, super thin. Almost paper thin, made of metal. And then hang up on the wall again with magnets. They send these um, to you with them. The way it works is you take one of these stickers, you put it on your drywall, take this and glue it right here with the glue that's already on there, onto here, and then this magnet will hold it flat against the wall for you. If you ever want to take it down permanently, just peel this off and it won't rip your paint. And then it hangs up on the wall. Um, they have some. All kinds of dip different displays from movie posters for Stranger Things to some gorgeous officially licensed cyberpunk artwork. You see Johnny in the reflection and V up there on the motorcycle. All kinds of stuff. They have video games like Dark Souls. Uh, they have Fallout posters as well. Let me show you some Fallout ones. If any of you are Bethesda fans, which I assume some of you are, look at this bad boy. Little Skyrim poster. We also have, of course, the classic. The Brotherhood of Steel Soldier in Fallout 3. I believe this is the, on the cover of the game. And, of course, I like this game. Starfield. They also have real life photos, maps, pictures, drawings, anime, large anime women and men. Um, 
licensed stuff, unlicensed stuff, freelance stuff, like all anything you think of, custom artwork like ours, what we have drawn up here. So check them out, exclamation point display in chat. There is a sale going on right now. If you click my link in the chat, or if you're on YouTube, the video description, you can check out uh, everything they have for sale. Let me see. Let's see what their current display is. Uh, their current sale is, if you buy one or two disc plates, you get 35% off. Um, oh, so right, one or two, you get 25% off. If you buy three or more, you get 35% off your order. So good time to stock up. Click our link in chat or the panel below the video. It applies the discount automatically and let them know that I sent you. And thanks to this plate for sponsoring us. Boom. Easy peasy. Beef 74, thank you. You can stop anime women I'm in. <laughs> I can see a purchase history of like what people have purchased, not who purchased it, but what items have been purchased. And I noticed that pictures of large breasted anime women seem to sell very well in our community. People are very big fans of, you know, supporting local art. You know? <laughs> Don't worry, I can't see I can't see who bought it. I just, all I can see is that someone in chat did buy one. When you click my link it lets me see like a history of everything that was purchased through our link. But not who though, so it's anonymous. Don't worry. Dr. Joseph was always busy treating anxiety and depression for office workers and posters from the capital. It seems he's luxury now, but sometimes nothing is more valuable than to talk to someone who will really listen. R Oh, God. Wait. I see arrows. Arrow, 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 arrow. Arrow. Arrow over there. What, is, what are these arrows for? Maybe in that hole there? I don't know what this is. It's a bunch of arrows. I don't know what they're for. Gotcha, sir. Bam. Okay, reloading. Charging sniper rifle. Nope. Ow, that was my leg. Woo! Blew his head. Skull eye socket. Huh. All right, uh, we need to get further. Wait, another arrow. What are these arrows are for yet? Well, I guess we'll find out. Uh, let's go towards the medical building, though. Yeah, I got an eye socket. I don't know what that's all about. Study Dr. Hudson's research. Now leasing. Right HQ. Ooh, there's the medical center. Let me go ahead and eat something because we need a little bit of food. 
Do I have any soup left? Um, juice, cakes, purified water. Last night played this was the start of coding up through hard time. Yeah, that we did a long playthrough that time. We played through the whole thing. So that's why I'm not going super in depth to the main story because we already did a lot of that. So we're gonna focus mostly on the new stuff once you get there. Right now we're just doing the old story to level. Uh oh. Oh, I remember. Wait, no, there. There's two versions of this. There's the Fallout 4 version of this hospital, and then this one, which I think is much easier. Dish rag. We got scorched. Oh, yeah. Boom. 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 Oh, my God. I I live Fallout, baby. That was three just beautiful headshots in a row. We are okay. Gone. They can't all be winners. <laughs> Got him. Take the sugar bombs. Braxo cleaner. Sweet potato stew. Ooh. Take that. Medical bag. Cooking container. Got her. there got him nice <laughs> gorgeous Study doctor's research. Um, well, it's down here. Let's see what, what we can find. Sorry. Damn, he got wrecked. Dr. Hudson's research. AVR Medical Laboratory. Inoculation Project Overview. Produce a vaccine against the mutagenic effect known as the Scorched Plague. Extract blood sample from three candidate creatures observed to be more resistant to scorched mutagenic effects. Use blood sample analysis to create uh, synthetic antibodies. Candidate Feral Ghoul. Project stalled until replacement T type T fuse can be acquired. Request filled with Responders, quartermaster, chain replicant placement. Place blood sample in the fuse and try again. Project journal. We're too late, it failed. Was on the radio with Maria now. She's never been seen so many scorched beasts. The sky above the airport's dark with them. They're not attacking, not yet. Waiting on their scorched foot soldiers to arrive, maybe. Clever bastards. And of course, we're scraping the bottom of the barrel on ammo and stems. This could be the come, couldn't come at a worse time. What the hell do I do now? Uh, Nuka Nerd, thank you for the sub. Uh, Degenados, thank you for the sub as well. Pounce Apex. 
blue pick. Thank you very much. All right, here we go. One brave doctor taking on the mysteries of the Scorch. How heroic. Truth is, I'm alone. I'm more than a little terrified. I'm skeptical the whole crazy idea will even work. I think the fundamentals are sound enough. But once I start analyzing the Scorch DNA, who knows what I'll find and whether I'll even understand it. But I have to try. If I don't, all the people I care about are as good as dead. And if the Scorch start to spread, I don't even want to think about it. At least I'm grateful I found this lab. It has everything I need, provided I can get all the equipment working. Hey, I've got this terminal reprogram. That's a pretty good start. Speaking of which, I better start writing that analysis program. No time to... Damn. There's that scratching noise again. Thought we'd clear this place out. But I swear there's something moving around the upper levels. Guess I better work fast. So I need to get a feral ghoul blood sample. And a T-type fuse. Light metal torso. Perfect. Let's see. Um, use that plan before I forget about it. Ooh, we got a couple of plans. Hot plate. Take the Microsoft. Micro the microscopes. The Microsoft. find another thing uh, the ammo that you tend that you tend to use tend to be what the enemies have I think that's on purpose like I noticed that once I switched the shotgun I started finding a lot more shotgun ammo but when I wasn't using a shotgun I saw a lot less of it I still saw some but not as much Got him. So I'm getting a lot of shotgun shells. So many. Yeah, it's contextual. Definitely seems to be that it's like based on what you use. They try, try to favor giving you the ammo that you use so you don't have to craft quite so much of it. For fun reasons. Toilet paper. Is inviting all players. New exploration team. I know that you get like. Uh... Increased XP just from joining a team, right? Bonus XP for events. Interesting. Defend Wade Airport. Oh. Yeah, you can play most of it solo. Um, events, there's going to be people that will randomly show up. But you can play on a private server if you want to do the sub. But otherwise, like, people just come in. They help you with the event, and they leave. They don't even say a word. So it's, like, not worth playing. It's perfectly fine to play solo and just, like, have someone help you randomly on an event. Because they, they are a little chaotic if you're doing it solo. Some of them are, not, are almost not soloable. They're very tough. Event uh, defend Wade Airport. Let's go back. But yeah, it's kind of like it's kind of like uh, Elder Scrolls Online, where you can play that entire game solo if you want to. Just have to group for like raids and dungeons and stuff, but you can don't have to speak to anybody if you're worried about talking to people. Waste oil. Prepare your defenses. Got him. Damn super mutants. Oh. 
They're like somehow bypassing our defenses. They're just sort of walking in the middle, responding in the middle. What are you fighting over there? <laughs> He's like sliding. <laughs> Yeah, you can join the public teams and just play solo. You get more XP doing that. You don't even have to be like near them. You just have to, just being in a team lets you like get passive like bonuses like that. It's kind of awesome. You can turn PvP off if you don't want to do PvP. Most people don't PvP. No! Uh, with PvP, uh, I would say about 95% of people don't PvP. 5% do, and then just for an achievement, just because they're an asshole once in a while, like, there's really not much reason to PvP in this game. So that's why most people don't. Retrieve your dropped loot. It was somewhere over... Oh, over there. Yeah, right over there. I'm gonna grab my loot. Uh, when I was, when someone was PvP moved me yesterday, like they were firing at me and I wasn't taking any damage at all when I had passive mode on. Gotcha. Alright, take all the stuff, please. Thank you. PB doesn't work unless you shoot back. Yeah, I think a ton of works. Uh, yesterday I was playing and two people came up to me when I was just doing my low level quest by myself and someone was like, hey, you pussy, like through voice chat. And I had to mute it so fast. I was like, oh, God, I can hear him. It was so weird. It just like, why? <laughs> I'm like, why? Why bother? Why do that? Who? What? Collect a, a blood sample from a pharaoh bull. Oh, yeah, that's right. Let's go back uh, over here and try to find... Oh, wait. No. Oh, let's let's break our stuff down. We got a lot of inventory stuff. We need to be free of all our garbage. Okay. Came from there. There's my little stuff right there. All right, let me break down all of this garbage. Gonna take everything from all those bodies and we're gonna scrap it all. Help this blade. True road. <laughs> Take me home. I got it stuck in my head. To the place. 
Babylon. Did I get any more meat for our daily quest? Grilled rad roach, nice. Grilled rad stag. Growing fungus soup. All right, let's try to eat some, eat the, all that food we just picked up. Nice, we got our uh, score bonus, perfect. What other uh, things would we be doing? Let's see, challenge, daily. Mole miners, I haven't seen any of those yet. Harvest corn, razor grain, or tato. Probably go to a farm for that. Build light sources in a workshop or camp, that should be easy. Uh, Flatty and Chachi, thank you for those those subs, guys. And Zol Zoltars, thank you very much. Oh, let's go down this way. Straight across. All right, we got to get some blood from a feral ghoul. Do you think he'll just let me have it easily without having to convince him? Probably not. Yeah, I started at level one just to uh, re-level and, you know, experience the game again. It's been a while since I last played, but you can um, feel free to start at level 20 now if you want. You, you can go right to 20 and skip into the game. What the hell is that? what that was but it's creepy looking yeah if any of you guys have um, Amazon Prime don't forget to claim this game for free in your uh, Prime Gaming they're giving this game away on PC and Xbox so wherever you like to play games if you don't already own it and if you already own it if you want to throw the, the code in the chat like chat will take it for you. oh god Oh, God. You gotta have that crit lined up. Disease Snally Gaster. Ugh. Yeah, that thing was not nice. This game has a really good variety of mutants. Like, this has more than probably all the other games combined. Like, it's a lot. Like, blood sample from a feral ghoul. Is there a ghoul around here somewhere? Oh, hi! <coughs> Got to reload. Reloading, reloading. Sir, sir, hold on, hold on! Yeah, if you guys want to post, uh, just tell if it's a PC or Xbox, just post them in the chat, and then people that don't have the game can just claim it and get it for themselves. You redeem it on the Microsoft Store. Assy. Quest started Ally Narrow State. Listen up. All Blood Eagles out there are invited to a show. We captured Beckett. If you want to see Blood roast a pig, then come on down to Poseidon. Bring your friends! If they ain't blood eagles, they'll get shredded too! Uh, quick blood sample. Perfect. Collect a T-site type fuse. Uh, load blood sample into centrifuge. Oh, it's a Snallygaster. Oh, no. Nope. Yeah. 
God, that thing's ugly. I'm suffering from snot ear. Ew. The hell is that? Ain't it smart being that MVP with 10 gift subs for chat? My God. It's gone insane. Okay, what does snot ears do for me? Minus two perception. Ew. So I guess there's snot coming out of my ears. Ooh. Disgusting. <laughs> Computer the Geek, thank you for 91 months. Let's go shove the blood sample into the computer and see what we need next. Probably feral ghouls, super mutants, and not the scorch. The scorch are definitely not immune. They have it. Roach meat, thanks. I think it's one floor up, maybe. Uh, the codes people drop in the chat are for the at Microsoft Store. Uh, Amazon Prime is giving away copies of this game. Uh, so if you have Amazon Prime, you already own the game, you just drop your code in the chat, and someone else who doesn't own the game can claim it. blood sample. Oh, place it in the centrifuge. Centrifuge. Centri... Oh, here. Analyze blood sample. Data for the symptomatic unit. Ready for inoculation. I still need a T-type fuse to do that. Oops. Oh, there's a bench right here to scrap stuff. Ah. Get rid of both those. Large magazine, nice. Hello, style buckle. Uh, this game uses a lot of um, assets from Fallout 4 to make new areas and stuff. So they might use the same like hallway and Basically, the way Bethesda creates games is they make a bunch of Lego pieces, and then you can put those Lego pieces to, in random orders to make different dungeons. Like, even, like, Skyrim, you'll, like, run into same, similar sections of a cave, like, in different caves. Collect a T-type fuse. Let's go find what that means. Oh, there we go. Uh, the Appalachian Mountains um, also are really haunted. There's like... All the myths are real. The Mothman. The Wendigo. All real creatures. Charleston train yard. Uh oh, I see communist robots. Now, <laughs> now, Liberator MK Zero. That guy looks like he might be a semi-elite. Oh, 
just a rare, I guess. Perfect. Uh, Vivek, thank you for the uh, the gift sub to I puked my pants. <laughs> huh. Okay. That is a screen name that someone could indeed have for themselves. Scrap all junk. Vibes are always cool here. Love you, Dan. Well, thank you, cool trainer. I think I hear a friend in there. Friend? I have a present for you. Must be stuck somewhere. T fuse. Install the T fuse. There you go, friend. I got you some buckshot because, you know, I'm a good guy. I like to share things with my friends. Alarm clock. Psycho rack. Bicycle. Jake, I'm telling you, I never felt better since I started using the bike. Yeah, I know. We're trained people, but I'm going to the city and back. Feel the healthiest I've ever been. I swear. Terminal. Hmm. Uh, believe. No. Require. Nope, can't be require. Can't be windows. Tunnels. Can we tunnels? Nope. Can't be resides. Can't the second letter can't actually could be. In sleep. Nope, can't be that. Denying. Nope. All right, let's do our hacks. Wait, there is... Oh, there's one. Another one. Another one. Do you know how long I play this before I realize you can do this? Another one there. Dollars. Nope. Terminals locked me out for a few seconds. Ceramic. Nothing. Ashamed. Nope. Can't. Nope. S. It can't share a single letter. Acids. Nailed it. Wait. Safe control. Is there a safe? It's right there. Oh. Take the shotgun. All right, let's head back and turn in our data. Uh oh. Oops. Oh, there's some stairs. Let's run into those. Uh, the letters can't be in the same spot. They can have the same letters, just can't be in the same like places. <coughs> the game's kind of like Wordle. You guess a letter, and then you figure out 
which letters are in the right places. But it doesn't tell you which letters are in the right places. You just have to kind of figure it out. All right, let's go um, install the T-Fuse over here. Rhythm Gamer, thank you for that 17-month resub. I'll take all that. All right, run over here and down, and we jump into the hole. Because any hole is the goal. Right there. Boom. Oh, fusion core. They definitely take that. Okay, we're in the hole now. Let's go over here. And jump down. Where do we put this T fuse in? Oh, right there. And now we get inoculated. Or die horribly. One or the other. Woo! Anti-armor short. Ooh, hunting rifle. You must have completed my work and enough. The next step is to find out if our elite anti scorched unit, the fire breathers, are still alive. You can find them at the Charleston Fire Department. The fire breathers need to know the vaccine is ready. If they didn't make it, then you're going to need their weapons to stay alive. Into the fire. Join the fire breathers. All right, let's see. We got a couple of recipes. Let's read those. Metal stools. Diluted rad at radax. Diluted rad away. Guess you just like water it down. <laughs> oh, fire breathers are right outside. Crafting item unlocked. Yep, uh, so you see this this map here? The map is massive. Like, it's huge. Like, we're just in this tiny, this whole city that we're, we've are we been in. It's just this area right here. So the, the area is huge. So and there's only 24 players, usually or less, on a server. So as you can see, like, most people are spread out. The white dots are players. So there's a bunch up here. There's a couple over there. There's no one around me at all. Most people just off doing their own thing. So you won't ever really run into people very often, which is nice. But if you do an event, which are these um, hexagons right here, those people will tend to flock to sometimes if it's a good event. If, but a lot of times people skip them if they're not. All right, guys. I'm going to go ahead and get off here for tonight. Um, I will be back on tomorrow. I'll play a lot more Fallout tomorrow. You guys have been absolutely wonderful tonight. Thank you for stopping by our short little bonus stream. And I will see everyone in the morning. You guys have a lovely evening and have a good night. So much for being MMO. It was never designed to be an MMO. It was meant to just be a multiplayer game. Um, MMO would be a very different game if they were trying to go for that. All right. I'll see you guys tomorrow. Bye, everybody. Have a good night. I'm Dan's Gaming. Don't forget to follow. And I'll see you guys tomorrow. Bye, guys.